Hey guys, welcome to your career in money reading for um, Capricorn. This is going to be for your May 2023. You can apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. So we are going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys in your career and your money. And then we'll finish off the reads to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective um, Capricorn people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading tailored to your specific unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live, okay? So tell me about Capricorn. What's going on with Capricorn when it comes to their career and their money? What does Capricorn need to know? What's surrounding Capricorn for May 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter signs for a Capricorn. All right, tell me about Capricorn in their careers and their money here. Career and money. Queen of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini with the Three of Pentacles here. And I feel like you guys are spearheading like a major project that you're working on here, Capricorn. Okay, uh, whatever you're working on here, I feel like things are going really, really well. I do feel like you are in charge here. Okay, you are calling all the shots. And I do feel like things are going pretty well. You know, I feel like a lot of, you know, I feel like this is opening the doors up for you and opportunities for the per people that you're working with here. Uh, you know, perhaps, you know, this can be, you know, um, you know, a, 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 a thing where, you know, this is going to set you up for a promotion. It's going to set your colleagues up for a promotion or a raise here or a bonus. Okay. The fool. Aries energy, Aquarius energy, the Page of Wands here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. This is so interesting. I feel like you're mentoring these colleagues here too. Yeah, I feel like, you know, maybe there are, you know, people that you are managing. You know, there, there are people that you're looking over here, okay? And I feel like you're doing a really good job teaching these individuals, okay? Um, Ten of Wands, okay, and the Ten of Swords, all right. This is interesting with the Ten of Wands here and the Ten of Swords. You know, one of the things I'm getting here is that I feel like there, this situation that you're in, I feel like you might have gotten everything that you could get out of this situation. I mean, I feel like with the Ten of Wands here and the Ten of Swords, you could be moving on from this. You could be ready for something really, really, really exciting. So this is kind of like the last thing that you might do here before you kind of leave. Okay, this is so interesting. It could be a situation that you're helping, you know, some of you guys might work in implementation or something like that. Some of you guys might be implementing this, these new things before you actually like leave it behind. You know, you're going to teach these people and then you're going to kind of set them up for, for success before you leave. Okay. Queen of Swords here. And we have the Hermit, Virgo Energy. Tell me the Three of Pentacles. And the Knight of Swords here, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Yeah, it seems like you have a lot of knowledge and wisdom that you're sharing here with your colleagues here. Okay. It's like I, like I said, I feel like this is the last thing that you could do to help perhaps your company here before you move on, move on to something new. The Hermit, Virgo, Energy, Knight of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, the Fool. You know, the Five of Swords, the Page of Wands here, and the Four of Pentacles. One of the things I'm getting here is I feel like you're looking out for yourself. I feel like you could be looking out for your health here. Maybe you guys are burnt out. Right now, I feel like, I mean, some of you guys could be taking a sabbatical or that you guys have taken a sabbatical here and it's about to end here too. Seems like right now you don't have a lot of energy to give. Yeah, it could be that you guys are burnt out. Yeah, you guys are burnt out here. The Ten of Wands. You know, the four, yes, just, you guys are looking to take a break. You guys are looking to rest here, uh, Capricorn. Ten of Swords in the Death card. 
this is interesting. Either you guys are ending employment here or that you guys are ready to retire. So just apply this to your own unique situation, the death card here. There's definitely something coming to an end or that you're closing something out here. But you're going to do something really uh, amazing uh, before you, you end things, okay? Um, what else do we have here for Capricorn? What else does Capricorn need to look out for, work on here for May 2023 when it comes to the career and their money? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs for Capricorn. Five of Cups, the Devil, Capricorn Energy. The King of Wands here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius Energy, King, Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, the High Priestess, and the Three of... <sighs> this is interesting. I do feel like someone here is trying to take care of their health. Okay. Um... I feel like someone here might have been recently diagnosed with like um, kind of like a long term condition here. You know, it could be, you know, something that compromises someone's immune system here. And one of the things I feel like, you know, there could be people in or around you that's talking to you, sort of like, you know, giving you advice to take care of yourself. And I feel like you, you're doing the wise thing here to take care of yourself. Yeah, you could have found out news, some sort of news that's not so great here. Yeah, someone here could have found out some news that's not so great here. It could also be another thing if it's not that situation. It could be that someone here is taking time off um, for maternity reasons, okay? Someone here could be going on maternity leave, okay? It's kind of like you're 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 tying up loose ends before you you take that break or before you end things here, right? So the five of cups. We have the seven of pentacles, the devil, and judgment, Sagittarius energy. This is interesting. This might be very specific to someone. Let's say someone here had like you know cancer, okay, and that cancer went into remission, okay. And it, it could be coming back again or that it's come back again, okay? So, you know, Capricorn, this doesn't have to apply to you. This could apply to someone that you know. You know, it could be uh, a mother or a father or a friend or, you know, a cousin, you know, a co-worker. It could be, you know, it, th these are really general reads, you know. Sometimes, you know, these reads don't apply to, you know, sometimes it doesn't apply to us. Uh, depending on the situation, sometimes it could apply to someone that you know that's going through this. Okay, so uh, Judgment, Sagittarius Energy. Tell me about the King of Wands here, the Star card, the Queen of Pentacles here, and the Four of Wands. Okay, you know, I typically don't do health readings, but I feel like, um, I feel like if that's the case, right, if it's like, you know, you've been in remission and then it's coming back, I do feel like it's, it's caught pretty early, so I feel like you're going to kick it pretty uh, quickly. Uh, or, or if this applies to someone that you know that's going through this. The star card here in the four of wands. Tell me about the high priestess with a page. Of, yeah, there's a message that you're getting here where I feel like it's going to rock your world here. Yeah, it's going to rock your world here. Three of swords and the five of wands here. Yeah, this is about someone here taking care of their health. Yeah, this is someone, this is something about someone taking care of their health here. Something is coming back around again. Yeah, it has some sort of like long-term disease or something like that. But yeah, it's, this is definitely going to rock your world. But I also feel like whoever this applies to, uh, someone here is catching this pretty early and feel like someone here is going to kick it pretty, pretty quickly too. Okay, so uh, Capricorn, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.